final, but he shot three of the Notts goals and played in most brilliant fashion throughout. reasons why I am leaving Chelsea but I shall be in the near future I'm not happy and the obvious thing is to to leave he was a great boss he was very clear in his definition of how he wanted us to play we knew what we had to do when we were out there. If we weren't functioning out there, other players on the pitch would let you know that, particularly Don Masson. I always believed that team could have played well. They would have got promotion for the third, third, the second. But they could have gone straight to the, into the first division without any shadow of a doubt. It's a, it's a wonderful success story of, uh, of Notts County Football Club. The Meadow Lane crowd salutes County's arrival in Division 1. From a manager's point of view, it was excellent because most of my players, I could tell you they were eight out of ten every week, occasionally a nine. There weren't many sevens and sixes, which is what every manager dreams of. But it was a great motivator. You know how to get his team together, and we went to some crazy places and did some crazy things, you know, and some things I've never done before with a football team. It's Bartlett gets the cross in. Johnson turns and scores! Johnson with the free kick, it's a curling one. Short gets to the header. Ahead. It was absolutely fantastic. To achieve it again the next year was, you know, even something special. Oh, Turner, kicked on there! Getting it into Tommy Johnson. A brilliant goal! And in it goes from Regis. As the final whistle goes. And Notts County, the oldest club in the Football League, are back in the First Division. A long throw by leg. Oh, the goalkeeper's missed it. It's gone directly in. It's deflected wide towards Devlin, who delivers an any cross. White's in there. Fabulous goal. And Notts County become the first English club to win the competition since Newcastle United back in 1973. And it really is a remarkable achievement. Job done. Trophy won. With March still with us. Oh, it was. Uh, it was the, the golden days. They was. We were celebrating for days and probably weeks afterwards. It was. It was phenomenal. I I'd never had it before in football, but it just felt that you weren't going to lose. It really did. You. It was so enjoyable, that feeling. You honestly went on that pitch and you did not think, you, we thought we were going to win every game. I look every season now, I don't want a team to beat that, and I don't think they will. Madness. It was a complete, utter con job that was. There was a lot of negative publicity around the club, but the players all just stayed focused on football, really, and, and that's what came true in the end. But once we beat Rotherham here 1-0, I thought we'd finish in the top three, and I thought once we'd beaten Rochdale, we may go on then and clinch the title. Just needed a bit more consistency, and that's when, when Steve Cottrell came and he gave us that, and, uh, you know, we're ripping the roars now. It's been great, I mean, for the, uh, for the players, for the fans and like, the staff, it's been a great day. I mean, you've got to treasure in these moments. I wish you all the best for the continuation of your clubs, one and a half centuries of history, and may its unique place in football continue to be honoured and remembered for many years to come.